My name is Gabrielle De Pietri. I'm an artist who works in lots of different media. Uh, it depends on what the idea is as to how the, the work will end up being. This particular work that I've done is a project to um, develop a three-team football game um, with the cooperation of a, a town full of people and their football clubs. It's called Three Teams and the work is the documentation of that process which took place over, over six months from me calling up completely out of the blue to ask people to be involved in the project to actually putting the game to the test in the end. I was at a football game for the first time. I went to the MCG and for some reason it occurred to me that all team, all team sports were between two teams and I wondered why there had never been a, a third team put into these team sports. Um, and so that idea kind of brewed away for a couple of years and I decided I had to put it to the test. The way that sport has developed as a kind of like us against them kind of scenario um, and a really binary uh, oppositional scenario is, is quite revealing about the, the limitations that we place on a lot of our thinking. So the way that we think about gender, the way that we think about politics, that's all reflected in the way that we um, have set up our sporting games. Um, and that's, I guess, kind of our human nature to do that. But I think that as we evolve, there's really a lot of sense in questioning that. And I think that, that by a simple addition of another team really cracks that open and gets us to look at why we've actually continued these traditions in sport and in other areas of life as well. Being a finalist in the Basil Sellers exhibition, I can now have the opportunity to present this project to an art audience. Normally it's, that's the first audience that sees a work that I or most other artists would do, but this particular work has been bringing art into the sporting community and, and has really existed quite in quite a lively way amongst the sporting community in, in Horsham. And so this is the first time that this project will be presented to a, a general and an art audience in Melbourne. So that's a really great opportunity.